This is the first initial episode of ZNM workshops. Uh, today we are going to show you how to make the heck, what are we going to make? A, a scramble golf picker upper where, you, where it's easier to pick up golf balls for, from the ground. Okay, well, you can do that both from a golf cart and you can also use it to pick up in the woods. I want to introduce myself. I am Kipa and this is Zach. And uh, let's start out telling you this is a simple thing to make and it is very cost efficient. In order to make this scramble pickup tool, you will need to have the following items. This is half inch PVC. This is a half inch wood dowel. You will need two different types of sandpaper, uh, P120 grade and one, uh, 400 grade sandpaper. Some type of cutting tool. This is a PVC cutting tool in which you can cut cleanly the PVC. However, you can also cut it with a fine saw or a hacksaw blade. In addition, you can purchase this item. You can get these items, Zach. The, these are golf ball pickup tools that you can get on Amazon. Make sure to get the screw that could be that you can uh, screw out by yourself. Yeah, it's important. Some of them have screws that are permanently attached <laughs> and they don't work quite as well because they're a heavier kind of screw. This, these, these types seem to work best. Uh, we have this type, which is a screw in type, and then Zach, show them your type. Uh, it, this type is a, is less of a screw in and it's more a of suction a type. suction cup. Now this one, like what they use in plungers. This one goes on the outside diameter of the pipe, where this one screws into the other end of the pipe. Now, in addition to these items, you're going to need a sixteenth of an inch bit drill. You'll also need two other drills, an eighth inch and a possibly a five thirty-second inch drill. Uh, you'll need a screwdriver, a drill, some three-quarter inch galvanized brads, some type of line. This is line from crab trapping, and this is uh, a leather um, rawhide strip, all of which could be used. Okay, we're going to start the manufacturing process right now. The first thing you do is you take the half-inch PVC, mark off a two-foot section, and then Jack, Zach is going to show you how, with this tool, we can cut this to the proper length. All right, squeeze here. Okay, let go now, and squeeze again. One more time. Good job. Now, take your dowel and cut off a three inch piece of dowel. Um, I'm not gonna do that right now. I have a pre-cut piece that I'm gonna use just to make things go a little faster. Take that dowel and you're going to wrap a piece of tape around that dowel. Zach, show them how to wrap that tape around that. Good piece of tape, very sturdy one Good too. Good job. Then you're going to insert that dowel into the end of the tube. Then you are going to take your 16th of an inch drill here. and you're going to drill a hole approximately two inches into, just start it, that's fine, and you'll take one of your three quarter inch brads and hammer that into That'll secure the wood into the PVC. After that, you're going to take your drill and with your 1 8 inch bit, you're going to drill 
Sounds pull. like a drill. Into the end with the wood dowel. About one inch. In the other end, with the 5 32nd inch bit, you're going to drill a hole into the other end of the PVC. Can I drill into that? What? Press. Good job. Now, basically, the process is completed except for finishing. So you have now an area in which you can screw in the pickup tool. Screw that in there. Oh, don't let's go on there. I didn't mm -hmm. see it like that. Screw it. There we go. Okay, screw it in. Yeah. Okay, okay. Keep going. You're going straight. Okay. Good job. Then you sand off all of the lettering that is on here. I'm going to demonstrate how to sand with it. It'll come off with the larger grit first. Once all the lettering is off, you go over it with the 400 grit. And then you basically have a finished product as long as you put on a piece of either of either the rawhide or of the rope supplied. Two alternatives, one with a suction cup that goes over, the other that screws into the end of the PVC, both with either rawhide or string. And you can use either the caps, these are half inch caps, they're about 67 cents, or you can use it without a cap all of which will work. Total cost of the project would be around $5, uh, assuming you make more than one. Otherwise, some of the PVC, if you buy smaller quantities, it might cost you an extra dollar or two to make. Now, Zach, do you have anything else you want to add? No, I don't. Okay. I would like to thank you for participating in our first uh, how-to video. We would like you to subscribe and, and, and like the video. That would like be helpful video. to us. A similar product on Amazon would cost about $39. You can make these at home for around five. Uh, they are very easy to make. There are different ways you can attach them to your cart, either with magnets or clips, or you can just lay them across the front of the golf cart. Or you can put them in your golf bag and they're helpful to get balls out of the woods. Thank you again for, for visiting with us. Uh, again, thank you. This has been a very popular product. My wife and all of her friends use this consistently when they're playing scrambles and also to get balls out of the woods. Uh, it's also very helpful for senior citizens in terms of picking up uh, balls. So uh, good luck and thank you.